Welcome to another community conversation. And I'm really excited today to have two members of the top 10 IT panel for 2022. We just uh, released the top 10 uh, of 2022 at our conference. And so the time is right to ask these two panel members uh, uh, to come today. Uh, welcome, Bella. Welcome, Phil. As you look over at the top 10 issues themselves, are there, are there themes you see woven throughout all 10 or most of the 10? other than the theme of, of students, of course. When I was thinking about themes, they feel like the kind of uh, exit pandemic themes anyway. So I, I think the, the top 10 kind of reflects that, but also reflects wider society. So we are coping with increased threat of, of all kinds um, to kind of normal operations um, and uh, demand for change uh, is across all, all of those uh, in the top 10 as well. And I think the really interesting part of, of the things that are woven in, and, and they're the things that I think we all struggle with, is how we respond to those two things by building up the right skill set uh, across our teams and, and our wider institutions. And the bigger, the bigger challenge is how you create the right culture, a fertile culture to be able to respond to all of those things. Yeah, for me, the, the themes that are really pervading throughout the, the top 10 this year is really the, what is the future of, of higher education? And these, these themes uh, actually precluded the um, a pandemic that's just been accelerated, right? We've now accelerated uh, what the 21st century looks like and the future of work, uh, the future of, uh, of learning. And, and now we're, we're reacting to that you know, very, very quickly. And we're seeing um, you know, that across all these themes of um, the future being you know, much more hybrid, creativity and other uh, skills beyond just digital skills uh, for this 21st century economy are very critical. Uh, and we're seeing that important to the IT leaders, right? To help uh, enable that. Um, and then of course, cybersecurity, uh, because everything is digital, right? This new, this new future is a completely digitally enabled university in everything that we do. Um, and so um, not only are we, our, ourselves and our teams much more critical, um, but the protection of all that, that digital technology uh, and data, uh, because it is extremely data driven as well, uh, is critical. And so, so that's exciting for me, right? Because we're really enabling, um, especially at scale for large universities uh, like Georgia State and, and others to be able to deliver um, a really amazing student experience uh, and hopefully at a very affordable cost as well. So when I think of, of the two of you, you on the uh, IT panel, I, I always think it's all about the panelists sort of you know, uh, unloading their amazing insights. Um, it, maybe you can tell in my saying that that I've never been on the panel, but um, but I'm curious. I, I imagine that it goes both ways, and that and that the process of really doing what we tend not to do is to sit and reflect on these things. You know, normally you're so busy just doing what you're doing, you don't you don't wouldn't make the time to sit and reflect. Do you find that you learn? a lot from the process of developing the top 10 IT issues? Definitely learn a lot um, and, and steal a lot <laughs> um, from the top 10 um, uh, issues. And just this year, as an example, you know, um, I personally and, and the university, we've been talking a lot about uh, skills and digital literacy and new skills that are needed uh, for the future for our students. Uh, and this year, um, you know, one of the questions that actually I um, uh, responded on was the skill of creativity. And that wasn't specifically called out in a lot of the things that I had talked about previously. Uh, and so that's something I've incorporated you know, directly into you know, the skills that we talk about preparing, when we talk about digital skills, uh, that creativity is really critical. Uh, and um, and, and is, is important because more and more of the routine skills are becoming driven by AI, whatever it may be, right? And so not only digital literacy in terms of computational thinking is important, but these other, uh, skills such as creativity are extremely important. So, um, so yes, have the, to your point, John, that, that time to step back and have that sort of 360 feedback loop and say, okay, yeah, that's really interesting. That's really manifesting itself into creativity being really critical as an example. One of the real benefits about being on a panel like this is, is sharing experience and thinking about um, how that would work in your own institution and, and um, kind of hearing people's stories about what's worked well, what we didn't. Things um, someone said to me 
a couple of weeks ago that you know you, you guys are a couple of months ahead of us over the Atlantic so uh, kind of knowing that things that are going to come down the line as well which is, is really useful as well and um, so it was it was a really great learning experience for me as well and, and something I'd like I'd love to do again okay well nice to see you both uh thanks for making time to be with me it's yeah, great I could see you. Cool.